Hey everyone, it's Brett Cavanis with the Cavanis Group at Compass, serving the Peninsula and Silicon Valley communities. I'm super fired up and excited because I just talked my clients out of buying a home. Yes, I know normally that's really not what my job is supposed to be as a realtor. I sell homes, uh, but in this case, I'm super excited that I just got my clients uh out, talk them out of uh, purchasing a property that would have gotten them into a lot of hot water in terms of e expenses incurred in the near future. How did that happen? Well, uh, one of the things I want to talk to you today about is pre-inspections and doing your due diligence before making an offer. In Silicon Valley, we're lucky enough that normally inspections and reports are all provided to us in advance, but sometimes there's not a complete set of information. And this is one of those perfect examples. I took my clients out to see a property, a beautiful, completely renovated home on the hillside in Belmont and it looked spectacular. My clients loved it. It had the updated kitchen, the updated bathrooms. It was light and bright and stainless steel appliances and fantastic. But I told my clients, wait, it looks nice. It looks great. And maybe it certainly is. But what we need to do next is I need to go back, pull disclosures, get them over to you. I'm going to take a look at them and I want to see what's underneath the hood is what I call it. Because I find this happens a lot of times. They make things look really nice and pretty so that you come in and get super excited, but they didn't take care of some of the major issues. And especially when we're talking about a hillside property, we want to be sure that it's stable and the foundation is strong and there's no big issues there. So lo and behold, we got back, we took a look at disclosures and the home inspector noted some possible issues with the foundation. And a lot of times what a seller will do is they'll even go to the extent of hiring a foundation expert to provide information so that buyers don't have any concerns and have all the information before an offer deadline. Well, this time they did not do that. So I told my clients, we do not have a full clear picture. And it's very hard to make a smart decision on several million of dollars uh, worth of real estate you're about to purchase when you don't have a clear picture and all the information. So I tell my clients, let's get you a clear picture so you can make a decision. So lucky enough for them uh, and for me, I'm excited to tell you that they did take my advice and I was able to contact foundation expert, even though the offer deadline was coming up just in a few days, I had a foundation expert come out to the property and actually meet live with myself and my clients there to go through the home in just about 30 to 45 minutes. He completed a complete inspection and was able to walk them through all of the facets of the home. And what did we find out? Well, we found out the foundation looks great. It's actually in much better condition than many properties, specifically hillside properties in Belmont. So that was fantastic, but there was a big but. So the real concern that he pointed out to us was the retaining wall system. So the property is a hillside property. And while the foundation looked good, the retaining walls were not in such good shape. And should they fail, you could have a whole landslide caving into the property at any one time. So based on the conversation with that foundation contractor, it sounded like that any, you know, just initial modification and not doing the entire project was likely going to start at 70 to $100,000. Had my clients not done this investigation before the offer deadline coming up in just a few days, they would have purchased the property. It looked great. It felt great. It was near their friends. It had the great schools. It had everything that they wanted. It didn't seem like any big deal in the inspections, but they would have moved in and found out very, very quickly that they needed to spend another $100,000 uh, right off the bat. But instead, they spent about $800 to hire a professional foundation contractor to come through and that is cheap insurance. So I am over the moon that my clients spent $800 to save them over $100,000 so that we can move on to a property that's going to be safe uh, for the long term for their family and a smart investment. So uh, please be careful when you're looking at properties. Uh, don't just judge a book by the cover, what it looks like on the outside walls. Let's dig in. Let's find out what's underneath there. If you ever have questions or need assistance, I would love to consult with you as your realtor here in Silicon Valley or the peninsula. And if you're thinking real estate anywhere else in the country and you want somebody who does as good of a job as I do where you're located, let me know. I've got an amazing set of referrals and connections all across the country. I want to make sure that you're protected and that you're making smart investment uh, uh, strategies uh, as you're purchasing your home and enjoying uh, what that means. Again, I'm Brett Cavins. That's a little bit on inspections and investigations before you're purchasing a home. Uh, contact me anytime. I'm Brett Cavins.